गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स आई एम नवदीप धालीवाल फैकल्टी ऑफ आर्य कॉलेज ऑफ इंजीनियरिंग एंड आई टी टूडे वी विल डिस्कस आवर टॉपिक वीडियोकॉन कैमरा ट्यूब द बेसिक प्रिंसिपल ऑफ वीडियोकॉन कैमरा ट्यूब इज फोटो कंडक्टिविटी वेयर रजिस्टेंस ऑफ फोटो कंडक्टिव सरफेस डिक्रीजेज विद इंक्रीज इन लाइट इंटेंसिटी वीडियोकॉन इज शॉर्ट ट्यूब विद ए लेंथ ऑफ ट्वेंटी टू ट्वेल्व टू ट्वेंटी सेंटीमीटर एंड डायमीटर बैटवीन वन पॉइंट फाइव टू फोर सेंटीमीटर रजिस्टेंस ऑफ सरफेस चेंजेस बैटवीन टू मेगा ओम टू ट्वेंटी मेगा ओम फॉर ब्राइट टू डार्क स्पॉट फॉर ब्राइट स्पॉट द रजिस्टेंस इज टू मेगा ओम एंड फॉर डार्क फॉर डार्क स्पॉट द रजिस्टेंस इज ट्वेंटी मेगा ओम now we will discuss about the um construction of vidicon camera tube the vidicon consists of a glass envelope with an optical flat face plate a photo register target plate is available on the inner side of the face plate the target plate has two layer to the front facing the face plate is a thin layer of tin oxide this transparent to light but electrically conductive to another side of target plate is coated with a semiconductor photosensitive antimony sulfide the tin oxide layer is conducted to power supply of 50 volt grid 1 is the electron gun consisting a cathode and a control grid the emitted electron are accelerated accelerated by a grid 2 the accelerated electron are focused on the photoconductive layer by grid 3 vertical and horizontal deflect deflection coil placed around the tube and used to deflect the electron beam for scanning now working the working of Uh, you know the basic principle of vidicon camera tube the basic principle is photo conductivity the working principle light will pass through a glass and after that light will pass through conductive coating now see this conductive coating that is having characteristics like its resistance that will change with respect to intensity of light after conductive coating photoconductive surface is also there c for conductive coating we will be taking output electrical signal of vidicon camera tube scanning and synchronization a still picture is fundamentally an arrangement of many darks and light areas a small area of light or sheet is called picture element all the elements contains the visual information in the scene if they are transmitted and reproduced in the same degree of light or shade as original and in proper position the picture will be produced in order to produce video signal for all the elements in the picture it is scanned by the electron beam one element at a time is sequential order the scanning is done in the same way as a written page is read to cover all the words in one line and all line on the page hence scanning is the process by which an electron beam spot is bit to move across a rectangular area as so as to cover it completely the rectangular area may be target surface in a television camera or the screen of a picture tube in a in a television receiver so here we can see the scanning process in the scanning process you can see the electron beam is started from top left to bottom right 
when electron beam is move from left to right it is called trace and when electron beam move left to right to left is it is this is called retrace the info the uh, the information is only in trace period in retrace period there is no information and the two type of scanning is there vertical scanning and horizontal scanning in vertical scanning the electron beam is moved from top to bottom and in horizontal scanning the electron beam is moved from left to right one by one all lines are scanned using electron beam the ski the scene is scanned rapidly both in horizontal and vertical direction simultaneously this provides sufficient number of complete picture or frame per second to give the illusion of continuous motion in most of the television system the frame repetition rate is 25 frame per second scanning and synchronization for scanning the picture element sawtooth potentials can be used sawtooth potentials are produced by using a unijunction transistor and a rc network sawtooth potential are applied to horizontal and vertical deflection plates in a tv camera when the sawtooth potential is applied to the horizontal plates called line synchronizing pulse thus for scanning the picture the three synchronizing pulses are used these synchronizing pulses along with the output of the tv camera are <coughs> modulated on an ultra high frequency carrier and transmitted the accompanying sound is frequency modulated and the transmitted by the same antenna interlace scanning in india the frame repetition rate has been standard at 25 frame per second this repetition rate is enough to cause an illusion of continuity but the brightness of one frame blends smoothly into the next through this time when the screen is blank between successive frames this results a definite flicker of light that is very annoying to be observed where the screen become alternately black and dark to eliminate this flicker each frame is scanned twice horizontal and vertical frequency the movement of electron beam spot from left to right and back so as to start a new line in the same direction is termed as horizontal scanning the horizontal scanning frequency is defined as the number of lines scanned per second in 625 line system transmitting 25 frames per second the horizontal frequency is 20 625 multiplied by 25 this is around um, 15625 hertz consequently time taken to scan one line is 1 by 64 vertical scanning is the moment of electron beam spot in the in, in the vertical direction one frame consists of two field resulting into 50 fields per second with a vertical field scan time of 1 divided by 50 is equal to 20 millisecond thank you